Hey guys, so um, I wanted to do a look using my sugar pill because I haven't used my sugar pill in quite a while. Um, so I wanted to use my sugar pill eyeshadows. I basically just did a really basic uh, orange and black cut crease and with some really strong lip. Um, using a bit of glitter on the lower lashes but I mean the lower lash line here. But like I've said before, um, when you use glitter just always be careful with it. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching guys. Bye. Okay, so I'm going to start with the usual, uh, my Makeup Forever Aqua Shadow Pencil in white. And this is just going to go under my eyebrows. Okay. Okay, just a little bit. Then I'm going for my favorite eyeshadow primer, the NARS Pro Prime. Smudge proof eyeshadow. I'm going to very quickly apply some loose powder under my eye. So I'm starting off with my sugar pill purple, uh, purple, orange. Why did I say purple? <coughs> okay, so the orange one is there. Very nice color. I forgot what the orange color is called actually, but yeah, it's just a very nice bright orange. I'm just going for a flat brush and I'm just packing that on. I really love the sugar pill colors. I cannot emphasize how much. I've I used to do so many videos last time using only sugar pill. Then I started venturing out into my other brands, but I'm back with sugar pill again. Okay, zoom that in a little bit more. Okay, all right. So um, you can see it's sort of a cut crease. So I'm gonna go ahead and cut my crease. I'm just I'm just gonna use my. Makeup Forever Aqua Cream in black because this stuff is amazing and it's practically smudge proof, it won't come off. So that also might be a bit of an issue because you're going to work fast with it. I'm just using um, an angled brush. This one is from Star Looks. They've got some really brilliant brushes. I'm just going to cut the crease. Okay, you don't have to worry about it being neat just because um, my eyebrows are so messy. Uh, just because it's all this is only gonna act as a guide, so I'm gonna go ahead and um, fill it in. I'm gonna use a flat shader brush like that, and just going for the black eyeshadow from Sugar Pill that's bulletproof, and I'm just going over that line. And then I'm going to go for a dark brown shade and just buff that out. Okay, so once I've blended, I'm going to apply the orange a little bit higher up just to fill in the gap there. So um, I just did the basics, I filled in my brows, did a basic eyeliner and I stuck on some lashes, I'm waiting for it to dry before I can curl them. So I'm just going to touch up on my eyeliner again a little bit. Yeah, I'm going to go for my pencil liner and I'm going to dip it inside my Makeup Forever Aqua Cream. And I'm just going to line my waterline. You can see how black it is, how intense it is. Okay, I'm gonna just curl the lashes now. And I'm just gonna apply some mascara. Okay, so if you want, you can obviously just leave it as this, but knowing me, I'm gonna make this a bit crazy. I'm gonna put some glitter on. Okay, I'm gonna start off first with using the sugar pill orange again and I'm just going to apply that to my lower lash line. Like I said, if you think the look was strong enough already, you can just skip this part and just complete your look there. But I'm going to go a bit crazy. Okay, and then I'm going to go for some glitter. Um, I've <coughs> Sorry, I have no idea where I got this from. Probably from some craft store or something, but it's just really basic 
it's not, not even cosmetic glitter, so it's just really basic glitter. Um, and I, I've said in my videos before, anytime you use glitter, please use it with caution because it can uh, really, really be dangerous to your eyes. So I'm going to use uh, my Ellie Splash Sealer Base yeah, Eyeshadow Sealer. And this is good for glitter. I'm just going to directly pop this bit by bit to where the orange eyeshadow is. Okay. I just only put it in the outer corners. Glitter brush. And just sticking that on. I can really feel it hurting my eyes. So, like I said, try to avoid glitter as much as possible. I'm just doing it for you guys for this video. I'm gonna remove it after that. Okay, uh, okay, no way. This one is coral. I'm gonna go with this coral lipstick. This one is from L'Oreal, it's magnetic coral and it's a super nice, vibrant coral shade. Okay, and then just to add a bit of highlight, I'm going to go for my MAC uh, Warp Seed Lipstick. And this really is just like a whitish sort of shade and just going to add it to the center. Like that. Okay, so that's the look. I hope you guys enjoyed watching it. Take care guys. Bye bye.